Alright folks, welcome back to Drinking with Jack. And Akeen I will notice that I have the same Hawaiian shirt on as the last two episodes. That's right, back to back to back, because that is how Jackie Jones rolls. That's right. So we got our vitamin water here. You know what I'm talking about if you watched uh, the previous episodes. Good times. Alright. We are here now to make the ultimate orange Patron margarita. Alright. Now, first of all, we're going to take a lime, the whole lime, that's right, we're going to cut up the, this lime right in half. We're going to juice this lime. You want the you want the lime juice, the juice of one lime. All right, folks. It's good times here on Drinking with Jack. Happy man here today. Good times indeed. All right, we got the lime juice in there. Now you want the juice of a lemon. We take this lemon, cut it right down the middle. You know how to juice a lemon, folks. If not, you're pretty freaking helpless. That's all I gotta say. From there, we're gonna add three ounces of Patron tequila. Look at that fancy bottle. Damn, that smells good. It's a lot of freaking tequila, folks. From there, we want to add two ounces of the orange Patron. That's right. Orange flavored Patron. Damn, that smells good. You want to mix this bad boy up. You can cut that recipe in half. Use the juice of a half a lemon. Use the juice of half a lime. Use one half ounce of the tequila and an ounce of the orange Patron. Mix that up. For all of the ladies out there, they always say uh, if you're shaking something, you, you make your own face. So if this impresses you, send me an email over at uh, jackiesbackbrother.hotmail.com. Alright, shake that bad boy up. Yourself a glass of ice, and you can put freaking salt on the rim. Whatever you want to do, folks. Jackie Jones has filmed three of these in a row, and he's feeling no pain at this moment. All right. Look at that. The ultimate. The ultimate orange Patron margarita. Damn, that is a mighty fine drink. Would be nice if I did have a little salt on the rim of the glass, but I don't. You can even put some sugar. Um, you could uh, put candied uh, lime zest, lemon zest. That's usually what I do. If this is too tart for you, you could add some uh, simple syrup, add some sugar. It's pretty good just the way it is, though. That is a mighty fine drink. It's not a drink you just want to chug down. You want to take your time. You want to savor this one. You want to enjoy this one. Be excellent. Friend, grill up some uh, fajitas. Grill up some tacos. That's not a racial uh, thing going on here. Just that it would go good with that. Why are you wearing a sombrero, Jack? Just want to get in the mood. Hmm. That's good stuff. If you're out there and you're watching these, you're like, man, I freaking love these Drinking with Jack episodes. How can I hear more of this guy? This guy knows what's going on in life. He enjoys a fine meal, enjoys a fine drink. Well, right on this station. You can watch interviews I did at Days of the Dead, other horror conventions. You can listen to interviews I've done on, on podcasts. You can check out iywhitewrestling.com here Wednesday at 8 and 5 p.m. Eastern. If you're into the wrestling, you can hear all my views in the wrestling world. Uh, you can check out withoutyourhead.com uh, every other Thursday night at 9 p.m. Eastern. You can check out the archives. It's good times. Check out my grilling videos here. I make um, lots of stuff on the grill. It's good times. I usually enjoy an adult beverage while I'm doing that as well.
You can check out Dinner and a Movie with myself and Annabelle Lecter, where we go around in the New England area, usually uh, up around Boston, and we review uh, horror films over dinner. A lot of luck, a little uh, banner going on. Good times, folks. I would highly recommend you check that out. Now, if you want to sell, want to sell for pri- if you want to win yourself a prize, courtesy of Dr. McGillicuddy's. Now you could drink, you could uh, you send me a recipe for a cocktail, a uh, shot, whatever it is, using uh, either lemon drop, uh, cherry, vanilla, black licorice, or even the apple pie. I've not even tried the apple pie yet. I'm waiting for a really nice recipe. So if you're out there, you're watching the show, send me a recipe for apple pie. Dr. McGillicuddy's, I'll use it on the show. And you win yourself a prize. Another thing you check out very soon that's going to actually be a Jack in the Morning show. So you're, t- you're like, man, I freaking love Jack. I don't care about wrestling. don't care about horror movies. I wonder what he thinks about just uh, entertainment life in general. Check out the new show, which maybe never even, might not even ever happen, but usually five or six in the morning. If I'm up, there'll be a Jack in the Morning. I'll have a random guest on there. It'll be good times. I'll probably even be drinking uh, maybe a margarita during that episode. Fine drink, folks. I'm going to uh, finish this one off and make myself some dinner. I want you guys to rate, comment, subscribe here to the channel. If you guys got a recipe, send it to me. If you enjoy these shows, let me know. If you hate them, keep it yourself. i got a fragile ego. I don't really need to know that. i got enough hatred in my life. So anyway, thank you guys for checking this out. And of course, the mantra is, good food, good drinks, good times. Until next time, everybody, this has been Drinking with Jack on YouTube.com slash Jack IYH. Que pasa, gringos?